in our previous class we had seen how to give anonymous users access to web application but there is a problem associated with that approach if we are implementing business objects in our web application i will show you what is that exactly suppose i am clicking on this live url and clicking on the web app this will open up a new browser window and we will get the web page details now same thing i will try in different browser where i have not logged into my idcs user so let me try it in google chrome clicking on enter as we have provided anonymous access to use the web page it is loading the web page but as soon as it tries to access the business object we are getting an option to log in because we are not yet provided access to anonymous users for the business object now let's check how to do that go back to application let me edit this application so first thing we need to make sure is click on this options over here or the home button and select settings here you have to make sure you have allow only secure applications to be created turned off I have turned off this one let me go back now let me open the application so next thing you have to make sure is go to business objects select department business object as of now we don't have department business objects consumed in the web page but still we will try to allow anonymous access go to security click on this role based security here there is an option allow anonymous user we need to give him view create update and delete options go back to employee business object go to security click on this access provide view create update and delete access to anonymous user go to location in real life scenario you won't have access for creating updating deleting only view access is there so because of the view access you will be able to view the catalogs in the e-commerce website even if you don't have create update delete so this will be basically right placing the order and checking out so these options will be only available if we log in only view option we can provide to the anonymous user but as of now i am enabling all the accesses to the anonymous user after enabling the security for anonymous access that is to access business objects next thing we have to make sure is click on this menu button on the right top corner go to settings go to business objects over here under security there is an option to allow anonymous access to business objects describe endpoints once done we can stage and publish the application in order to do that we can do right away from this option as well go to menu click on stage from here we can select populate stage with development data click on stage we can publish right away from here publish so this is another way how you can publish the application right from the designer i want to replace live with stage data click on publish in my case stage and live data are one and the same because we didn't insert any details from the live url to business objects okay let's now verify let me open this web page in a new window this i am opening in a google chrome in a different browser application i have opened in ms edge as you can see this time our application is loaded successfully even that sdp access it's doing now if you click on this again we are getting the details this time we have view update delete and insert access for anonymous users allowed on the business object because of that this table is getting populated from the business object so we are seeing all those details populated even we can export the data to csv this also is working everything will work fine so like this we can allow anonymous user to access the web page and also the details within the web page what it shows with the help of business objects